dig. Thank God. Ricky, what's wrong? Do you know a man named Joshua Harper? Harp? Uh, yeah, yeah, I know him. I never trusted this son of a bitch. He uh, wrapped the black bandana around his head like he was some goddamn hipster or something. Yeah, well, your instincts are pretty spot on. He shot Dan Lane in the back over a card game and took off. Oh, Jesus, where is he now? A patrol spotted him heading south. They were too scared to even approach him. I guess he'd met up with a group of drifters. I really need your help on this one. Okay, uh, I'll handle it. I marked where they spotted him on your map. Thanks, Deke. No idea how to fix it. Good to see you, Deke. Hey, Buzz. Deacon St. John, how have you been? How's it going, Buzz? You go through a lot of this shit, yeah? Okay. Should have new shit later. Stop by. Got good shit in stock today. Wow. More venison. Wait a second, I got it. I'll, I'll be right there. Deacon out. Finally. Jesus. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, fresh meat. Ricky, looks like Harbin's men are heading to Camp Creek. You sure you can handle this? Oh, gunshots. What the hell? Just asking. Cross Lake out. Okay, come on. Let's just do this the easy way, huh? got to him before I did. Jesus. Bring back his headscarf. Dance people want proof that Harper is dead. Yeah, okay, well, this might be a little bit messy. Fine. All right, sure. Yes.
Bounties can use this. Might be useful. Hey, got it. Oh, Jesus, what a mess. Okay, head back and talk to Ricky. Get my credits updated. Okay. Crease there. Okay, got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you go, that's better. Okay. Hey, brother. Look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, well, I was all Deacon. <laughs> oh, that's yeah, really, really that. cool, Boozer. Hey, uh, I could have been one of those, those yeah. three goddamn musketeers. Hungar! Oh, you fucking that's ripper. Right. Pretty cool. Oh, hey. Jesus. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, uh, maybe this hey. wasn't that good of an idea? God damn it. Okay. Hey, Ricky, uh, here's Harp's bandana. My husband used to collect oh, mess. tools the way I Yep, that's what I said. Thanks, Deke. I'll let Dan's people know. Couple of guys burned out a nest a few weeks back. You know, uh, the freaker nest. Call them. A female came. What do you call them? A screamer? Yeah, let me tell you. They call them that. St. John, you there? It's O'Brien. Hold on. Brian, I'm sick of doing your dirty work. You got news for me or not? Yeah, I, I mean, yes, I have news. Well, then what is it? I need you to do one last job. Will you listen to what I was just saying? I'm done with one this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. It was Irene, right? Sarah 
One last job. One last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Hey, hey. You're headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, O'Brien? Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah? Nah, I... Skizzle's got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck Skizzle, I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? Tell him he twisted my arm. Never gets old, <laughs> does it? Over toward Malakwa Lake. You know where that is? Yeah, it's just north of the road tunnel off uh, Waldo Road. So what are we doing there? The Nero Chopper's gonna be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So, O'Brien, he's, uh, he's what? Your, your shot caller? Handler? No! Jesus, Boozer, you know why the hell we're out here. Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump, you ask how high. It's not how it is. you holding up? Not bad. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working the farm, pulling weeds and shit. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. Spend summers working the beet fields. <laughs> yeah, a little dirt bike I took around on. That's where I learned to ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you Farmer Bill. Sight, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, okay, got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. Hey, thanks for bringing me along, Pete. It's good to get out again. Even riding bitch, you know? <laughs> yeah. Okay, stay close. Right behind you. There it is. Down. Jesus. Move out. I thought I'd see one of those okay. again. Let's get this done. Here I need. All right, now watch. So, just come out first. They secure the LZ. Then their boy genius, researcher, scientist, whatever the hell, he comes out. He looks around. What? Whatever science shit they're doing out here. How the hell would I know? Okay, wait here. samples. You mean shit. Yes. Freak shit. Yes. <laughs> so we're 
not here in the middle of nowhere, so you can pick up freak shit. Precisely. <laughs> okay. Enough said. Field note 2102. After analysis of scat samples from zones 2, 3, and 4B, there is clear evidence of Claytonia perfoliata. What's that? Commonly known as miner's lettuce. Please don't interrupt. As well as manicious berries from Juniperus commonus. So, why do we care? Why do we care? Because it means the freaks are eating more than two. We need the area secured now. Spread out and lock this shit down. Standing by. Now, we're picking up scat samples. <sighs> you mean shit? Yes. Freak <laughs> shit? Yes. So, we're out here in the middle of nowhere, so you can pick up freak shit. Precisely. <laughs> okay, enough said. Field note 2102. After analysis of scat samples from zones 2, 3, and 4B, there's clear evidence of Claytonia Pupiliata. What's that?
Spencer talk. Really? <laughs> okay, if you must know, we're picking up scat samples. You mean shit? Yes. Freak shit? Yes. <laughs> so, we're out here in the middle of nowhere, so you can pick up freak shit. Precisely. <laughs> okay. Enough said. Field note 2102. After analysis of scat samples from zones 2, 3, and 4B, there is clear evidence of Claytonia what? profoliata. What's that? Commonly known as yeah. miners' lettuce. Please don't interrupt. As well as pernicious berries from Juniperus communis. So, why do we care? Why do we care? Because it means the freaks are eating more than just us and each other. They're eating berries, plants, grass, needles, basically anything a deer would eat. They're omnivores, just like us, but with stomachs that can digest a much wider range of cellulose. Yeah, okay. And what? It means they're not gonna starve yeah. when they run out of us to eat. The freaks aren't going away anytime soon. Be a drifter in the LZ. Hey, anyone else hear that? You catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money, and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing, or why? Oh, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south. And with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Yeah. Where are we headed now? It's a good question. O'Brien, are you there? Come in, O'Brien. I'm here. Finished? Yeah, it's done. Where am I meeting you? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'm sending you the coordinates now, but it might take a few minutes to get there. O'Brien out. Jesus, what the hell does he think I've been doing out here? Hey, you're right about one thing. He does sound like an asshole. Wait here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. Okay, I'll be back. O'Brien said he had news. He knew her middle name, Irene. She can't be alive. But he's alive. Why not her, huh? There he is. Yo. Shit. Gotta stop doing that. What you got? All right, look. I'm gonna lay it out for you, but it's not good news. 
I finally found a guy who was willing to do some digging through some files that, we, that they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, no problem. Uh, anyway, uh, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was in, admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. Uh, according to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she survived. The stab wound, she survived. Yeah, uh, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery. And then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of Tumult. Okay, so... so she could still be alive. Even after all this time, she could still be alive, you're saying? No. What do you mean, no? It was overrun. Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 look. There was nothing that would have protected that camp, okay? Highway 97 w w is an artery. Infected freaks poured up from L.A., from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel. Some feds. People with clearance. Nero personnel. The soldiers. The guys with the guns. The guys that should have been protecting no, no, the there's civilians. There's nothing that you can do against a horde. Oh, They're no, too strong. I know all about hordes. Oh, I know that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. There was no hope. There was no time. There was no room. Okay, there was, we'd already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand. If you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would have been dead the next morning. You did the right thing. <laughs> You know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? <laughs> O'Brien. Thank you for saving her life that night. So you're sorry. Is that it, O'Brien? You're sorry? Oh, damn it. All things a waste of my goddamn time. Boozer? Boozer? Oh, God damn it, Booze, man. Where the hell did you go? Ah, oh, shit. Ah, right. Booze, man, where the hell did you go? Boot tracks. It's gotta be his. What the hell is this? All right, where? Uh, this way. Deke, you still there? This is Ricky. Deacon St. John. Uh, yeah, Ricky, I'm here. What's up? Schizo's been asking for you. Said Boozer never showed up for his work duty. I, I was worried. No, look, we're fine. We just had some stuff that we needed to get done. Tell Schizo we'll be back in an hour. Okay. Hey, 
I'm almost ready to head back out there and fix that transformer. You still in? Uh, yeah. Yeah, just the... Great, let me know when. I can feel that hot water now. I'm gonna let that shower run forever. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's... that it sounds great. Listen, uh, Ricky, I, I gotta go, all right? Deacon out. Over here! Oh, Jesus, Boozer, what the hell? I figured I'd do a little shopping while we were out, and I ran into a pack of rippers hunting dogs. Oh, easy, fella. He's not infected. He's, he's just a dog. They're hunting down and killing healthy dogs. No, just, no, we can't, we can't leave him here, Deke. Uh, we just, we can't, we right, can't do right, it. Here, here, let me, uh, let me do it. Really? You, you can... Okay, boy. Okay, you see, it's okay. All right, just... Oh, Jesus, it. Deke. It's okay, just... That's it, all right. It's okay, big guy. Rest. Sounds disappointed. Well, I just, I hate those sons of bitches, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, let's uh, let's get the hell out of here. So what the hell happened back there? You seem sort of, I don't know, like uh, like you lost it. Uh, I don't know. I guess I just, I needed some payback for this shit. But uh, there's never gonna be enough payback, is there? You know. If you hadn't made this shift for me, you know, my arm, I mean, I don't know where I'd be. I mean, I guess I, well, you know. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, not like I got a choice, not like any of us do, right? Yeah, okay, come on.
Hey, there's your bike. Hey, how'd it go? How'd uh, what go? You know, goddamn well, your guy in the space suit, what'd he say? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. Hey, come on, goddamn it. <sighs> Boozer, you really don't want to be doing that right now. Oh, yeah? You think I need more than this to take down your scrawny little ass? Come on, what'd he say? Drop it. Seriously, what happened to Sarah? Huh? Where's your old lady? Where's your old lady? Huh? <laughs> Stay down, brother. <laughs> Had enough? Where's your old lady, Deke? She's dead, Boozer. Sarah's dead. Yeah. And she's been dead a long time. So don't you think that you mourned her long enough? You have a hell of a left hook, asshole. Oh. Yeah, it's the only move I got. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh. I gotta get my sorry ass back to work. Camp ain't gonna feed itself. Okay. Yeah. It's the only move I got. Still, I tagged your ass with it three times in a row. Oh, fucking shit, Paul. <laughs> Where are we headed? Back to camp. No, no. I still gotta work a shift. Give me a ride up there. It's it's just north of Sherman's camp. Okay. So, she died that night, and there was nothing you or anyone could have done about it. I should have been there. And what good would that have done? Just drop it, it's done. Skizzo, you there? Lost Lake Camp, Skizzo. Yeah, yeah, what's up? We just had a run in with. Hey, where the hell is your bro? He skipped work duty today. What the hell, man? Just, just, just shut up and listen to me. I was giving him a ride to the work site, and we were attacked by rippers. Oh, Jesus. Where? Outside of Rogue Camp. You gotta tell Iron Mike. Carlos is coming, and he is not going to stop. What do you think I've been telling? For months. Yeah, I'll let him know. We're heading toward Tumalo now. Boozer will be at the site in a few minutes. Well, that's great, because he owes the camp another half shift for the work he's missed. Shut up, Skizzo. Hey, Deke. Uh, road camp is kind of in the opposite direction of Tumalo, isn't it? We took the scenic route. Out. Asshole. Goddamn Skizzo. Here. Come on, you guys. Come on, keep working. Keep at it. We don't work, we don't eat. That's it. Hey. Thanks for the ride.
Take John to Lost Lake Camp. Come back. Deke, I hear you. Mike. Good. Look, Boozer and I, uh, we just had a run-in with Rippers. They... Rippers? God damn it, you boys crossed the Iron Ridge. Deke, I told you. Just listen. No, Mike. They were here in Rogue Camp. Rogue Camp? There were Rippers in Rogue Camp? You sure it was Rippers? I'm not sure it's... Oh, Jesus, Mike, yeah. They're kind of hard to miss, you know, with the scars and acting crazy, killing anything that moves. All right, just calm down. We got a parlay with Carlos. This gives us heading over to Iron Butte tomorrow. He'll find out what the hell's going on, and then we'll... You're sending Schizo to parlay with Carlos. Jesus, Mike. Don't tell me how to run my camp, Deke. Like I said, my treaty is gonna hold. Lost Lake out. Hell, whatever you say, Mike. Whatever you say, Schizo's right. You're gonna get everyone killed. Deacon St. John, this is Lost Lake. Come in. Yeah, Mike. This is Deke. I heard you tracked down Harp. I was hoping you'd bring him in for trial. Well, sorry, Mike. He, uh, le let's say the Swarmers had other ideas about that. Oh, shit. Ricky didn't tell me that. Harp wasn't the kind of man you ever turned your back to, but he didn't deserve to go out like that. Uh, I guess not. Uh, but then I guess Dan Lane didn't deserve to get shot in the back either. See you, Deke. Iron Mike out.